Hey guys, I'm TJ. And I'm Carissa. And get ready, because today we're gonna do a super fun science experiment. And it's gonna help us learn more about Jesus. It's even gonna make us go... Wow! <laughs> guys, today we get to do a super fun science experiment. Yeah, and my friend Selena gave us all of these supplies. She's a science teacher. That's awesome, but what are we supposed to do? Well, she actually sent us a video to tell us what to do with all of these. Let's check it out. All right, guys, on the count of three, I want you guys to press play with me. One, two, three. Hey guys, for today's fun science experiment, we're going to be making milk art. You're probably thinking, why do we have so much milk? <laughs> but it's not for you guys to drink today. You're actually gonna be making some really cool art. First, you're going to be pouring the milk into the containers that you have then adding a few drops of food coloring wherever you want. After that, you're gonna take a cotton swab, put a little bit of dish soap on the top, and then place it in the milk. The chemicals in the soap will react with the fat in the milk in a really cool way. Then, the milk will actually move all around. I can't wait for you to see what happens. I also gave you a science log, where you're going to write down what you think's gonna happen, and then write down what actually does happen. I can't wait to hear how it goes. Have fun! Wow, that seems super awesome. Let's try it out. We've got our milk. Yes. All right, we're just gonna pour some into our, whoa, it's spilling all over, okay. We've got some into our plate. All right, next then, we get to choose uh, our colors. I'm gonna go with blue and pink. Whoa, the whoa. pink totally looks red. This is awesome. Okay. I'm excited to see what happens with this. Well, Carissa, let me see that soap. All right, here okay. you go. I'm gonna put a few blue drops in here. Whoa, soap, okay. All right, there you got go. your soap on there? I got mine. I'm, I'm gonna, gonna wait mine. for you. Whoa. All right. Okay, are we ready? I think we're ready. Cheers. All right, on the count of three. One, two, three, go. What? Wow, look at that. That is awesome. Look at that purple. Oh, there's some blue in there too. It's like tie-dye. It's Woo. all mixing together. This is awesome. Okay, now let's try and do one together. All right, deal. All right, let's give it a shot. All right, you ready? All right, you pour from that side, I'll pour from this side. Cheers. Cheers, here we go. And done. All right, let's do first some purple. That sounds like a good idea to me. You do purple, okay. and I will do blue. All right, here we go. Okay. I'm gonna make a smiley face. There you go. Okay, let's see here. I'm gonna make a heart if I can. Woohoo, look at that. I think we're just about ready for the soap here, Carissa. Okay, here you go. All right. All right. Put some soap on my cotton swab here. I'll wait for you again. Here we go. All right. I think we're ready. You guys ready to check it out? Okay. Here we go. One, two, three, go. Whoa. What? Check that out. Woohoo! Look at them going. Oh, mine's going to come get yours. The green. Oh, mine is going all over the place. Whoa. That was super cool. You know what I think we need to do next? Make this even bigger. What? See? A bigger container? Yeah. Kids, you want to do it with us? Yeah! All right, let's try it. All right, kids. We said that we needed something bigger and better. Well, now we have even more milk. And how about this container? Whoa! This is huge. Carissa, you think this will work? I think it's going to work. OK. Let's go ahead and start pouring all of this milk. We ready? All right. All right, goggles on. And let's do it. Ugh. All right, guys, now we have this whole container filled with milk. Now, what we're gonna do next is we're gonna go ahead and get our science log, and we're gonna log what we think, uh, how far the colors are gonna go. Is it gonna go this far, this far, or this far? We'll see. All okay, right. I say we start with purple. All right, let's okay. do it. Here we go. We're gonna go ahead and start it right here. Oh, boy. Awesome. Let's get another color in there. What color should we do, TJ? We have pink. Let's do pink. Okay, pink. Awesome. Got it. Pink. Here we go. One, two, and three. Maybe okay. one more color. Yeah. How about uh, blue? Blue. Love it. Let's okay. do it. All right. We've got blue here. Let's put that in. One and two. Awesome. Okay. 
All right, right, guys, here we go. We're gonna see how far it goes. Ready, Kay. set, go. Whoa. Whoa, check that out. It's actually going this way. Wow, look at what? that. Next, let's add some glitter to it. That's a great idea. All right. Red All right. glitter over here. And now let's add some glitter. All right, here we go. Oh, that's a lot of glitter. Carissa, I think we're coming close to the end of our masterpiece here. Here we go. Man, this is looking so cool. This looks like cereal. Check this out. Look at it. It's like a galaxy. As you get it spinning. Oh, look at that. Okay, keep it spinning, Carissa. Keep it spinning. Here we go. Whoa. Whoa. Look at this one over here. And some glitter. Don't forget the glitter. Okay. Whoa. Add some purple. Okay. Wow, this is beautiful. All righty, Carissa. I think we did it. We made a masterpiece. Woohoo! Wow, that was incredible. Man, I've never done milk art before. Me either. And who would have thought that just by using some dish soap and food coloring, that we would be able to make this milk turn into so many cool shapes and colors? <laughs> that definitely makes me go wow. Yeah, that makes me go wow too. But you know what else makes me go wow? Is something that Jesus did in our Bible story today. See, we got to see all of these colors move right before our very eyes. But Jesus, he healed a man who was born blind and helped him see. That's incredible. Let's check it out. Stories of the Bible. Jesus heals a man born blind. This is Jesus. hey -o! Who is the Son of God and the Savior of the world. While Jesus was on earth, he taught everyone about God's love. He did many miracles and healed people of their sickness. Oh, hey, everyone. One day, Jesus was walking with his disciples, and he saw a man who was born blind. Hey, Jesus. His disciples wondered whose fault it was that this man was blind. Jesus told them it was not because anyone sinned, but rather it was because the power of God could be shown through this man's life. Then Jesus spit on the ground and made mud. He spread the mud over the blind man's eyes and told him, go wash yourself in the pool of Siloam. So the man went and did as Jesus said, and he could see. The man's neighbors and others who knew him as the blind man wondered if this was the same man. Is that the same guy? No way. They said, no, he just looks like him. You're right. No, there he is. But the blind man kept saying, yes, it's me. So the people asked, who healed you? What happened? And the man told them all that Jesus had done for him. Oh, that's what happened. The people asked, where is Jesus now? But the man didn't know. Come on, you. So the people took the man to the Pharisees because it was the Sabbath, the day of rest, and they thought Jesus shouldn't have made mud and healed the man on the Sabbath. The Pharisees asked the man so many questions. Eh, what's going on? And he answered them, I was blind, but now I can see. The Pharisees kept asking more questions. They even brought the man's parents in to ask them questions, but they wouldn't answer because they were afraid of the Pharisees. Finally, the man had enough and yelled, Look, I told you once, why do you want to hear it again? If this man were not from God, he couldn't have made me see. The Pharisees were so mad at the man for saying this that they threw him out of the synagogue. Jesus heard what happened, oh, hey there. and he found the man and asked him, Do you believe in the Son of Man? The man answered, Who is he, sir? I want to believe in him. You have seen him, Jesus said, and he is speaking to you. Wow! Yes, Lord, I believe. And he worshipped Jesus. Wow, that was amazing. Yeah, this was super cool to see before our eyes. But Jesus healing the man who was blind? 
Now that makes me go wow. Guys, who makes you go wow? Jesus makes me go wow. Let's say that again. Who makes, makes you go, go wow? wow? Jesus, Jesus makes, makes me go, go wow. wow. Jesus is so powerful. Yeah, and to help us remember how powerful Jesus is, you guys can do this milk experiment at home. We even have this super cool science log for you to be able to take to use with an adult when you try it. Well, we had so much fun today hanging out with you guys, and we hope you have an awesome time learning more about Jesus and worshiping Him. We'll see you guys back next time for another experiment. Bye! Bye.